I'm a farm manager for the teacher family and they've been farming and growing fruit for about 70 years now. We have uh, 600 hectares of arable um, and, then, and about 80 hectares of top fruit. There's 40 hectares of uh, culinary Bramley apples and then uh, 30 hectares of, of gala. Um, inclu and, and if included in that is 5 hectares of Kanzi uh, and 10 hectares of pears. Uh, the Kanzi actually makes up 17% of our uh, dessert variety. We first planted Kanzi in 2005, uh, so from 2006 onwards we've had a, a partial crop from them. Um, our sort of five hectares is up to full cropping now. Uh, Kanzi is a very prolific variety um, and, and light is very important so we have to be uh, very careful with tree structure to make sure we're getting enough light in to get the colour. Um, other varieties can rely on cold nights near harvest whereas uh, Kanzi just needs direct sunlight to get the, the perfect colour. Considerable investment has been put in over the last five years. Uh, we're, we're trying to uh, make the orchards a lot younger so we've, we've, we've put a lot of new orchards in. Uh, the dessert varieties have got irrigation in with them. Uh, we've had to put new stores up and refurbish old stores so that we can keep fruit for longer. I think we'd need to see more shelf space in the supermarkets so that the retailers and, and the consumers can see what a premium apple it really is. I'd like to see more throughput and demand from the supermarkets and then uh, if, if we've got the demand we, we can follow by planting new trees. Um, I'm not really involved at all in the, in the breeding aspect of them but uh, what we do do as growers is, is give feedback to the nurseries as to uh, any problems with the trees. The perfect Kanzi apple is, is sort of a, a very symmetrical cone shaped apple uh, like this one here. Um, a nice bright red on one side, uh, nice green background colour on the other side, very clean skinned, um, they're very crisp to the, to the, uh, the bite, um, very juicy and uh, once they've been in store and if, if they come out post Christmas they're, they're, they're a very nice apple to eat. Uh, my wife likes using them for apple tarts. <laughs>